Hey guys, it's Kim Dow here. Welcome back to my vlog channel. So today I have a very fun video which I can't wait to show you guys. If you have been watching my channel last year, you would have seen that I went to South Korea with Nongshim. And if you guys know me, Jin Ramyeon is my favorite instant noodle of all time. I used to eat one every day so my mom kind of banned me from eating them a while ago earlier this year we had a trip to south korea planned i was so excited for it but of course because of everything that happened this year it could not happen because we aren't allowed to travel overseas even though the south korea trip got cancelled we still really wanted to do something with nongshim so instead we decided to enjoy shin ramyeon at home because it doesn't matter if you're in south korea or in australia at least the shin ramyeon taste is still the same so i teamed up with other influencers tara milk tea and jk vibe we spent a few days together just you know enjoying shin ramyeon and of course we made sure that it was 100 percent safe we had a Bunch of activities planned which was really fun so let's go on to the first day hey guys look look at this we have shin ramyeon earrings which i am so going to put on and then we have a shin ramyeon beanie and a hoodie let's just get changed and go down to meet everyone i have not worn a beanie in so long and it's actually in the middle of winter in australia right now so this is perfect to keep me warm and snug and then plus we got these adorable earrings. I'm gonna change mine out. Oh yeah, I am ready. Guys, we have arrived and they set up some pocha, which is like a Korean food store. Look how amazing this looks. We have a chef, Morgan, who's going to be cooking for us today. And I'm so excited. I can smell the Shin Ramyeon already. I was so surprised that they set up this Korean pocha right in the backyard. Like I really felt like I was in South Korea. We had celebrity chef Morgan McGlone cook for us and he had a bunch of Korean dishes on the menu. It was amazing because he cooked for us all night. Tara Milk Tea and Kayla and Jace. Oh. We also have the pots that they use in like Korean dramas when they eat noodles as well. So it's really cool, even though we can't travel right now, we can still bring Korean culture to our backyard in Australia. Thank you. That's part of the pot, you know? And, we, and guess what? You don't even get a bill. Oh, <laughs> we have our own personal chef with no bill. <laughs> Whenever you want. Oh. I mean, I'm going to be here all night, so... Oh, okay. <laughs> this is so nice. Like, <laughs> I wish I could have this every day. Um, you have... We have pork belly, shiitake mushroom, white radish, Snook, uh, sorry, uh, bean sprouts. Surprise me. Okay. But don't put bean sprouts in there. You don't like bean sprouts? Yeah, I, I don't do bean sprouts. No problem. Ooh, this is the stock of that. Yeah, so I made like an anchovy white radish stock. Wow. I'm gonna just butter you yes. and green onion you. And then, do you want a little bit of green chili? Yeah, why yeah. not? I've never heard of anyone putting butter in this. I'm, I'm so curious. Yeah, it's. I mean, I don't put a lot. I'd love to put a lot. Yeah. But um, if if, if it's your first time, you know, I don't want to. Yeah. It's, Whoa. It's, it's <laughs> oh. And oh, it smells so good. Look at that, guys. This is the fanciest in ramyeon I've wow. ever had. That tastes so different. Oh my gosh, it's like al dente. This is I mean, really good. So good. I think we've it's come. amazing. I'm gonna definitely put butter next time. Mm. 
We just finished dinner, cleaned up the area, now everyone's inside and we're gonna play games. We're gonna be playing some overcooked. It's so cute. It tastes really good as well. Oh, this is really soft, so good. I got it, I got it, I got it. Oh, this is so stressful. Oh my god. Hey guys, it's the next day and I'm just relaxing in front of this beautiful place we are staying in. And yeah, last night was really fun. I actually felt like I was in Korea. So like I said before, we were supposed to travel to Korea and learn more about Shin Ramyeon, but unfortunately because of everything going on, we couldn't do that. But the pocha, I actually felt like I was sitting in a Korean, I guess, street food store eating and the food was amazing. The way the chef used stock instead of just plain water to boil the noodles was oh so good and adding butter in shin ramyeon like I never thought of that but it just really elevated the flavors so I never had shin ramyeon that good before so today we have a bunch of other fun activities planned I can't wait to show you guys we'll be having a lot of Korean food so yeah look forward to that activity we are going to be doing like a mini glamping picnic session and we're going to be making buddha jigae so well we're not going to be making it there's going to be a chef making us buddha jigae i'm very excited because it's one of my favorite korean dishes the setup it's so adorable oh thank you so much so we got our buddha jigae and look at this beautiful view it's so serene So we finished the lunch and then we ended up sitting inside the house for a couple of hours to catch up But as you can see it's dark now and we are doing something else with Shin Ramyeon So they have set up inside the house a movie projector and we are going to be watching Parasite and eating Ramdong So if you've seen Parasite, Ramdong is something that they eat in the movie I have seen Parasite like a couple of months ago though I've never tried Ramdong so Chef Morgan is going to be making that for us and we're going to be eating that whilst watching the movie so that's going to be very exciting So because we are going to be doing a movie night, I want to be comfortable, so I'm actually going to be changing into some PJs. I am now in my PJs <laughs> and I'm ready to watch. So we're gonna use um, Japagetti and Shinram. Ramdon in the movie was just like Japagetti. Yeah. And they just put like beautiful Hanui beef in there. Mm. And then what I'm what I've done, so I'm gonna basically do Japagetti, Shinram, and then I've made a sort of like a mix of uh, mushroom and abalone with garlic soy butter, giving that sort of richness of the, the, the family and parasite. Mm -hmm. And then we have tri-tip from Rangers Valley, beautiful uh, wagyu tri-tip, little like sunny side egg. Oh nice. And then we got a little garnish of uh, green onion and uh, seaweed. Yes, perfect. So you just mix it all up, nice. go to town.
So we have seaweed on top, sesame, we have chili flakes, an egg and steak underneath. I'm going to eat the beef first because I don't want it to overcook in the sauce. First bite of the beef. Mm -hmm. That is juicy. Just trying to cool it down. I'm not really good with hot food, like temperature wise. Wow. That flavor is different. I love it. It's not as spicy because I only used half of the Shin Ramyeon spice packet and I used half of the Chapagetti one. Oh, this is just amazing. All right, we're going to be watching Parasite now. finished the movie and now we're just having some, I guess, dinner snacks with the staff. Oh, fried chicken. Come on, baby. Oh. Come on, that's Basically, the chicken is ready. Yeah. It's like KFC wicked wings. Yeah, that's like what... Oh, thank you. That's, actually, a, that's a big compliment. That's a big compliment. That's a big compliment. Yeah. I love them because they're my favourite. So, so I let them rest for a couple of minutes. You won MasterChef too, weren't you? Yeah, six and ten. Yeah, <laughs> hell yeah. Chloe, man. Hell I love yeah. you, Chloe. You're good. <laughs> no MSG chicken salt. Perfect. KFC Wicked Wings. Wow! KFC! KFC! KFC. Yeah. I'm gonna try Morgan's fried chicken. It's really hot still. Mm. Oh my god. Morgan, this is so good. Yeah. Yum. Yeah, it's like KFC. This stuff is so juicy and his chicken salt is amazing. So everyone's just enjoying themselves and um, me and Jace from JK Vibe, we decided to play Overwatch. <laughs> we put our laptops and we're gonna play Overwatch. That is the end of the weekend where Nongshim bought Korea to us in Australia. Like last year, Nongshim is doing another Shin to win competition. So if you watched my videos last year, you would have seen that Nongshim had a competition where you can win a trip to South Korea. Because we cannot travel internationally right now, instead there are cash prizes. So to enter, you need to get one of these five pack Shin Ramyeon and you need to make sure that it has the Shin to win branding on it. Inside you'll get a scratchy where you can just scratch off the code and enter it into the website to enter into the competition. Everything will be linked down below so make sure you guys check that out in the description box. But yeah overall it was such a fun and chill weekend. I learned a lot from Chef Morgan because as you guys know like you know I've been trying to improve my cooking skills and I've been taking any opportunity that I can to learn from chefs. So yeah I asked Chef Morgan like a lot of questions and and I learned a lot and he changed my life by adding butter into Shin Ramyeon. Something I never thought of before but mm, it is delicious. I highly recommend that to everyone. In the next video, we are going to have a cooking class with Morgan. We're going to be learning how to make Shin Ramyeon in different ways. So that's going to be very exciting. Hope you guys look forward to it. And yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. I really wish that we were able to go to South Korea and vlog that because that would have been so fun. But you know, we are making the best of the situation and equally I still had a lot of fun over the weekend. So for now, stay safe. Let's all hope that we can travel again next year. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys. Bye.